Hey guys, this is Math Grizzly Outdoors. Just got done doing a sheath for a uh, shrad, a SCHFS or F9. Sorry about that. It's a pretty decent knife. Uh, price on this isn't too bad. They're like 40 bucks or so, 40, 45. Um, decent steel. But I love this uh, this belly design on knives. It just adds a lot more cutting power behind it. A good thick handle, so nice and comfortable. Um, if I could show you this, let's get down with the sheath. Uh, this is the sheath that comes with it. It's a nylon, and this pouch actually goes on the face of that one. And wraps around. Uh, but that's the advantage of the milled slots. You can do stuff like that. There's also, I mean, grab something quick. For example, this is one with the Maxpedition single mag pouch. Uh, this fits a uh, Leatherman. Really nice, or a spare mag. So it adds more utility to your sheet. So I've been doing some of these. Uh, this one works pretty good. The Maxpedition seems to be the nicest. It's got a little bit thinner strap so it fits through the, the webbing. Nice Condor makes one that I've used. Uh, that fits pretty decent, but it's not the greatest pouch. Uh, this Expedition is a good pouch. <clears throat> but anyway, that's uh, one advantage to the milled slots is being able to put stuff like that on top of it. Uh, this one's got the D-ring, uh, the dangler loop, milled slots, and then a fire steel. Nice retention, it's not going to fall out, but yeah, it comes out pretty good. Hangs really nice. And this also adds the option here to add a uh, nylon webbing, a one inch for a leg strap or something. So I figured I'd show you that guy. Um, so for a all around survival knife for the price, this wasn't a bad, a bad size knife. Looks like you baton with it pretty good. It's got uh, a six and a half inch blade. You can choke up on it here pretty good. It's with this finger groove. But it's not too huge uh, to where you couldn't do some smaller stuff with it. So just a quick review. I'm not going to go beat up the knife or anything because this is a customer's. So this is just kind of a quick, uh, kind of my thoughts on it. Nice thick blade. You know, when I see a knife that's got uh, some good features to it that is cheap in price for some of the guys that are on a tighter budget, um, I just like to show them and give my thoughts on it. It's got a nice rubbery handle to it. Like I said, for 45 bucks, uh, you can't can't really beat it for that price. Um, something that would be similar to this would be like a BK7, which is a great knife in size and stuff. You're looking at like 85 to 90 bucks, somewhere in there. So half the price of like a BK7. And of course, uh, the Kydex sheath for it. Alright guys, it's a quick video here, I'm going to show you this guy, um, thanks for watching.